This time of year, you hear the term bricks a lot. In fact, there's even a local restaurant called Bricks. Bricks is a measurement of sugar, and sugar is really important because the sugar determines the alcohol. When the winemaker adds the yeast, he can figure that when the yeast is done using up the sugar, a little over half of that will uh, convert to alcohol. The rest converts to heat and carbon dioxide gas. So if he started at uh, 24 uh, degrees bricks, which is about the same as 24% sugar, he'd expect to wind up at maybe 13, 13.5 13 uh, alcohol. Uh, how do we measure it? We've got a nifty little instrument. This is called a refractometer, although I remember uh, bringing some uh, wine club members out here for a tour, and when I brought this out, he said, oh, you've got the Brixometer, which makes a lot of sense because it measures the bricks. So uh, what I'm going to do here is I'm going to squeeze a little grape juice onto the lens of the refractometer. This is kind of like a prism. It's going to uh, gauge by the how much the light bends uh, the soluble solids in the grape juice. Oh, that's a good one. I should have eaten it. It's over 24 degrees bricks. It's nearly 25 uh, degrees bricks or percent sugar. Very sweet. When you buy grapes at the grocery store, they're usually 15 to 20 percent sugar is all. Um, now, the winemaker won't take one grape to get a sugar reading for, say, a one-acre section of vineyard. He's going to get a representative sample and juice that, and then that's the juice that will go onto the lens of the refractometer. But as I said, we're measuring um, soluble solids, and what we know from experience is about 90% of the soluble solids is uh, sugar. Of course, sugar and alcohol aren't the only things that the winemaker needs to worry about. Our winemaker, Jeff Gorsuch, uh, is measuring the pH, which is kind of the strength of the acidity. It has a lot to do with the health and stability of the wine. And he's measuring the acidity, which is important for, for all wines. A good solid acidity makes the wine bright, fresh, and makes it food friendly. Also helps it to age well. Uh, but flavor, flavor is the most important thing of all.